Hello everyone and welcome to our tips and tricks video series. My name is Scott Wolf and I'm a consultant with eCapital Advisors, a partner of Workday Adaptive Planning. The topic for our tips and tricks video today is going to be expanding and collapsing within Office Connect, an Excel add-in that comes along with Workday Adaptive Planning. The functionality that this uh, tip is going to provide is it's going to allow you to drill in to the most granular level in one click where previously uh, you could only uh, expand one level at a time. So this will work on your accounts, time periods, levels, um, attributes, and dimensions. Um, and the use case for this is going to be um, when doing ad hoc analysis. So we may see a summary level account and want to see what's making up that total. In one click, we can expand and get all the lower level accounts that are making up that total. Or we may see a um, total time period, for example, the full year 2021. Uh, in one click, we can expand that out to the lowest level of time periods we have in the system, whether that's days, weeks, months, and see what's making up uh, the total for the year. So let's hop into um, Excel and look at how this tip works. As you can see here, I have a board report pulled up here in Office Connect. Uh, I have the Office Connect tab here at the top, um, and you can see a bunch of different tabs here. I've created a specific ad hoc uh, tab for this demo, and you can see we have a summary level expenses line, we have a total company value, and then we have our full year 2020 and full year uh, 2021 um, columns one for actuals and one for working budget. The first example I'll show here is a summary level account. So we're looking at our total operating expenses here. In one simple click, I can highlight that row, use the expand dropdown and expand all and see uh, all of the lower level accounts that are making up the total operating expenses. And as you can see, as I scroll down here, um, that's gonna give me all of my accounts that make up our operating expenses line. Uh, previously, how this worked would be with just one click on expand, it would take you to the next level. You would then have to expand all of these individually. This can now all be done in one simple click. The next example I'll show is with our total company here, which is gonna be our level structure. In one simple click here, I can expand all and see all of our um, entities and departments making up a total company value. So I can see the total here and then the breakdown by entity and department. The final one I'll show here is going to be with our time periods. So I want to expand out our actuals from 2020. I'll expand, I'll expand, and then I'll pick time, click OK. And this is going to give me down to the day our actuals. As you can see, uh, that's the most granular time period. Uh, you could also do this with months or quarters as well. That is all for our tips and tricks video today. For more content like this, uh, please check out the eCapital Advisors website or our LinkedIn page. Thank you for attending our video today.